Welcome back inside Hayes Gymnasium here on a Friday night as we get set for tonight's matchup between the Flying Fleet out of Erskine College in Due West, South Carolina, and the homestanding North Greenville University Lady Crusaders. Dodge back to serve again. Little digs it. Pogue one hand sets it. Hester hits it over. Erskine has a chance to return here. Green though hits it into the corner and gets the point. Lady Crusaders now up four as Pierce drops back to serve again to Kirk. Dodge will set. Here comes number seven, Duncan, and finally the fleet catch a break. Samantha Hebb is in, another offensive weapon for NGU as Kirk is back to serve. Little goes down to get it. Pogel set. Tepidino behind her. Pounds it across the court, and North Greenville is at set point 24-21. Yeah, now they're on set point. So if they lose, if they lose a point here, watch Coach Mosley, see if he doesn't take a timeout. Tepidino serves. Mendez set by Dodge. Here comes number eight. Pushed it out. Oh, good play, good play. Nice, nice call that time. They good eye to watch that ball go out of bounds. Mayfield can't keep it alive for Erskine. North Greenville takes the first set, 25-21. So overall, a good start for North Greenville. Mendez to serve. Trips the net, Little goes down to get it. Here comes Cagle, dug by the libero Kirk. Running set by Dodge at the net. Hit over the blockers, but Pogue looking for that shot. Recovered by Erskine. Here comes Duncan, and again, that's Three, it's three straight for her. Served by Ashlyn Wilkinson, short. Dodge sets at the net, and yeah, it's Sammy Harden. No, no problems there. Yeah, Sammy Harden using that Laguna Beach six foot two inch frame now. She definitely spiked that one straight down. Looks like the Fleet are three and one on the season in four set games, so Erskine looking not too shabby in that category. Pogue one hand sets it for Hester. Dug by number six for Erskine. And North Campbell had to take that point, and here comes Pierce. <laughs> Hebb checks back in for North Greenville. They're going to need a rally as Pierce serves. Mendez, Dodge will set. They go to number eight, Mayfield. And she puts this one to bed. So Erskine falls in the first set, but a dominant second set, 25-15. So no matter what, this one's going to four. And Duncan not having any problem serving. She goes to little Pogue sets. Here comes Tepidino off the block, recovered nicely by Mendez. Swung over by Dodge, but North Greenville not having any of it. Here's Dodge again on the set. Harding and gets it down as Sammy Harding has come back with a vengeance here in the third set. Dodge to serve. Shockley. Here's Pogue setting it for Hebb, and she pounds it. Into yeah, the there, Gray. That's the that's the shot I've been waiting for all night. That hard spike. We've been seeing too many just little tip overs, but that hard spike got. Kirk serves. Hebb gets it. Pogue at the net, pushed over by the setter Dodge, and that is the third set done and over with. Hester serves. Dodge sets, Mendez recovered nicely by Pope. Now Pierce gets the set from Waters and there's a little firepower from Pierce. Yeah, she finally came alive over off that post, that far post now, that, that's her spot. Pippadino fires away again to Mendez, set by Dodge, they go to Grineau and she splits the difference between Tepidino and Little. Yeah, there's that hard spike again. Very effective for both teams. So North Greenville with a two-point lead, trying to force five against the South Division leaders, the Erskine Flying Fleet. Almost a miscommunication there as they go to Peyton Duncan. Popped up off the block from McAdams. Pogue sets it up. McAdams tips it over. Erskine with another shot. Here comes Duncan, and it is out. It is out. Now Erskine can't believe it. 
Yeah, I wasn't sure about that call, Gray. That both corner coaches looking at each other and both of them shaking their heads. I didn't see a signal from either one, but fortunately a point for the Lady Crusaders. A player to do it is back to serve. Mayfield swings at it. Waters, and that's it. Well, it was a good game, Gray. I really thought we might go five sets, but boy, the Flying Fleet, Lady Flying Fleet out of Erskine brought it together right at the end of this fourth set. Yeah, Erskine ends the set on a 7-0 run to close it out in four.